Explain to me your character in this film. This film I played a snitch. Stick called me maybe about three months before he wanted to film my part. He was like, you know what, I need you to play a crackhead, a snitch. He was like, I need you to lose some weight, I need you to slim down, because you know I'm a big guy. So I was like, ah, you know, this is Hollywood. It's, it's easy to starve here, don't worry about it. I, I look like a crackhead when it's around about that time. So, you know, that time came, he called me, he was like, yo, so we need you to do your part in such and such day. I was like, sure, I came in, I was all skinny and cracked out, like, yo, yo. And it was a, yo, I had a ball. Now, how much weight did you lose? Oh, man, for this role, I must have, I think I lost, like, maybe 20 pounds. 20, yeah, I lost, like, 20 pounds. And I tried to stay cut, you know, so when, I, when it was time to gain my weight back, I could, you know, put it on. So I lost, like, 10, 20 pounds for this. How did you lose it? I, actually, I worked out every morning. I got up and I went and I, I did like, you know, marathon runners are real skinny. So what I did was I would run around the track over in um, Sherman Oaks. I can't remember the name of the park. I don't know. I think it was Magnolia Park, but I would run around the big track and just run and, you know, and I ate a lot of, um, what do you call that, um, eggs and um, spinach. Yeah, a lot of protein with um, y Yuppie Joe Scramble at uh, Mel's. <laughs> When it comes to this film and the fact that it's all in rap, what do you want people to walk away with after seeing it? You know what? I want people to walk away with a sense of the artistic side of having rap and acting and there's no like straight dialogue as far as speaking to one another. I want people to realize like there's a new way you can look at rap. You know, you understand what I'm saying? There's a new type of rap instead of just rapping at you or rapping to you. It's like rapping like speaking you know was it difficult to do that for you well i'm a rapper i was once um in a group i'm still a part of the group edo g and the bulldogs so he called me he said i want a rapper actor and so therefore it worked out fine you know and one last question about michael jackson are you surprised at all about everything that's going on right now regarding him you know what i tip my hat to michael jackson if i have one and i am surprised um you know, I feel bad that he left so early because I know he had so much more to give us. You know, we asked so much of him already. You know, we always say that you're crazy if you didn't give us a hit. Oh, he didn't give us a hit this year. Oh, Mike's crazy. Oh, you know, but deep down and I think everybody's heart, we're going to miss Mike. And we know that he was like a big part of, of, of music the way we, you know, he... He was the one who helped us come up with that style and rapping and that flash and that look because he come out with the diamonds on his socks, the glove, and you know what I'm saying? He gave us that flair, that swagger, you know? So we're going to really miss Mike. I know I am.